My name is Jamal Doman, the count of three. I want to say, what's up, Jamal? One, two, three. What's up, Jamal? I'm happy to be here. I'm feeling good, working out. Got a new training, new workout program. Yeah. 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 Trying to get back down to my original weight. Eight pounds, six ounces. <laughs> <laughs> trying to get that newborn swag back. <laughs> I'm working out because I'm trying to date. You know, it's hard to date in California. A lot of gold diggers live out here, right? I dated this girl last year, she was a gold digger. She complained the whole time we was together, complained. Jamal, take me somewhere expensive. You never take me no place expensive. So I took her to the gas station. <laughs> Fill up pump ain't bring me out of Slim Jim. <laughs> this recession is something, isn't it? It's rough out there, everybody. Everybody's going through hard times, am I right? I was on Sunset Boulevard early today. I saw two pimps carpooling. <laughs> they had all they in the back seat, laughed up. <laughs> it's rough now, man. You ever wake up in the morning and think you're a special type of broke? Like I woke up this morning thinking to myself, I'm like broke to the third pile. I'm like a new type of broke. This ain't no regular broke. I know I'm broke. I got a letter from my bank last week. They told me I bounced a money order. <laughs> Say, bring cash next time. <laughs> you get some money, man. It's rough out there. My friends took me to the strip club. The stripper told the stripper, he been in movies, he been on television, he's a comedian. The stripper don't know I'm broke. That money gone. That was one check. It's <laughs> one check is gone. She, she started giving me a lap dance. She got dollar signs and I was talking about Jamal, make it rain. Jamal, make it rain. I'm like, I can make it drizzle. I got six dollars in my pocket. <laughs> they said it's gonna be sunshine tomorrow. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Gas got everybody broke, right? Mm -hmm. Gas so high now, I only date girls in my neighborhood. I'm like, if I can't walk to your apartment, this lady should be gonna work out, boo. I'm gonna let you know right now. <laughs> I'm telling you, gas changed the way guys approach women. This changed the way men approach women. I'm at the mall the other day. I'm outside the foot, like I see a beautiful woman. Oh, she was beautiful. She was a dime. I had to step to her. I had to approach. I was like, hey, excuse me, can I ask you your name? She's like, Jasmine. I said, Jasmine, nice to meet you. I'm Jamal. She's like, Jamal, nice to meet you. I said, Jasmine, do you have a man? Are you single? She said, no, I don't have a man right now. I'm single. I said, well, cool. You know, I had to jump on. I said, listen, that's my business card. I would love to take you out, you know, go get something to drink. That's cool with you. She's like, fine, no problem. As long as you come pick me up, Jamal, because I don't drive. So I have no problem with you taking me out as long as you come pick me up. I was like, cool, I'll come get you. She's walking away. I was like, by the way, where you live at? She's like, Victorville. Give me my car back. <laughs> Better catch the train down here. 